what's up guys welcome back to across nigeria this is where we do news on politics celebrities and also metro stories and please i am pleading with you if this is your first time of watching any of my video um i only need your support by clicking on that red subscribe button and you can also click on that bell icon so you get notified whenever i bring you stories um and i always try to make sure i bring you breaking news whenever it drops that's why um sometimes i do news with my mobile phone so you won't miss out okay so today's video i want us to you know brainstorm together one of the chief ten of um apc you know um efcc invaded his polling unit to checkmate um, vote buying you see when Buari did what what i noticed i i really don't know if everybody have their own point of view but when Buari was in power okay let me read the news for you so that we know um what we are doing so the efcc officials on saturday that was um that is the election day um stormed the polling unit of the national leader of the all progressive congress that is apc we are talking about bola tinibu all right so officials of the anti-craft agency were spotted at the polling unit at sunday at diegun street Alausa, the Ikeja area of Lagos State, in the morning before Tinubu cast his vote. So it was gathered that the EFCC officials were there to checkmate incident of vote buying. So this is um, the point. Many people were surprised to see the EFCC officials at the polling unit, at that unit, but nobody was arrested. You know, normally they are not supposed to be there i mean uh, even if security agency are there they, they know very well that um that is the polling unit of the national leader of the apc now another thing um i i want to put in place is that um after buari won um, his election we we noticed a lot of court cases you know, with the uh, APC chieftain, um, candidate, and so on. There were a lot of sucking up and down um, of the APC candidate, uh, reason based known to them, but we we saw that in the news. But PDP, this is what I noticed, APC, well, let me just confess, I'm not a political party uh, supporter, but what I, what I noticed about APC, their house is not in order, you know. How, how can you see an example in case of cross river state two um, aspiring governor fighting between them in the same party you know waneno and um, usan usani here yeah. you know uh, you see this uh, different poster uh, this one will have his own primaries this one will have his own primary uh, this one taking this one to court this one taking this one to court no you're not supposed to be so you you, you the house is not always in order. I mean, it, not only in Crossway, but that's the um, way I have knowledge of, and it happens everywhere. But PDP, yeah, they are organized. Everybody can say that. So, the real question here now is um, why did the EFCC, you know, storm the polling unit of Oga himself, that is the national leader of the APC? They, they know that. Um, after Buari, you see um, Tinibu, but now what I notice, I really, I am very sure the second term of Mr. Buari, he's not going to spare anybody. He, he, he will try his best. You know, uh, there were a lot of um, finger saying that Buari is fighting one side corruption. Yes, uh, everybody was saying so, and everybody is still saying so. Uh, because I made a story, um, two of my previous story talking about the same 
issue and um, somebody attacked me saying let him go and fight the naval force okay you know uh, Bari is trying to probe Obasanjo and PDP for their misappropriated use of funds during the they are staying 16 years so uh, somebody was telling me let him go and fight Tinibu for so he knows about all those things Tinibu is working freely um, okay just look at the case of bullion van entering his compound uh, imagine with billions of naira mon laundering money and um, nobody get to investigate anything the EFCC nobody cared to ask any question but um so far so good i believe everything now is normal so i don't know what you guys think but that is my own suggestion so coincide news report that senator remy tinibu had told legotians to show me your hand get the money that is the wife of um, tinibu show me your hand yeah the news was there on the internet everywhere show me your hand and get the money you know what it means okay show your hand and get the money so Tinibu said this on Saturday after casting a vote in the governorship and state assembly election at the polling unit 034 Falomo police barracks for Ikoi so the senator who was re-elected two weeks ago was besieged by a crowd of people after casting a ballot so speaking on the crowd making momentary demands from her she said show me your hand and get the money okay she spoke in pidgin yoruba and um, isekiri language so but she said but um said she was not into vote buying all right so that was um a speculation she was not into vote buying so um EFCC, I hell. So uh, they are doing a good job. Yeah. So I really, I really think Buhari, his second term, will try. He will try as much as possible to prove to Nigerians that um, yes, we are not fools. We are seeing what is going on. Okay. The likes of um, I, I really don't know why I like talking about this man, Akbabio. Yeah, he's a free world. Um, the speech is free. You know, he have a lot of cases to answer, but since he defected to APC, the sins were forgiven. I think um, that was what the national chairman said. If you are in APC, all your sins have been forgiven. Okay, Ojuz or Kalu, the former governor of Abia said the same thing. He had the case of um, billions of Naira, but oh, he is he, now a senator as well. He was even re-elected as a senator. So we, we didn't really know how corruption was um okay how body was fighting corruption so i believe his second term um this corruption fight will have we will have to see uh, the real effect of this corruption fight so you guys um i i, I wanted this to be um an opinion session so you can well, put your own opinion on the comment section below no insult um, i'm only here to interact with you guys nothing more and please um, if this is your first time support me by clicking on that red subscribe button i am out i'm there we all brainstorm together we reply our um we reply our comments together and see the headway i will see you in the next video thank you for watching